Hey everybody, happy new merchandise unboxing with Allison and Heather. Um, we are squished in to the tiniest space here in the in the streaming <laughs> area here at the Beating Dreams. It's VV Small and as you can see I have my, my new fashionable headgear so though it keeps like it, it keeps doing that. That's, that's not maybe the best look. Well, I don't have a top of my head, so I'm, I'm not one to talk. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can give you a top of your head. Look, oh, Heather, hey. Heather has an entire head. Hey. She, she doesn't actually end at the at the, at the the forehead. Um, she actually has the entire head, not just the front of it. Um, so welcome to the Hair Beating Dreams. and everything. I know, right? Welcome to the Beating Dreams live merchandise unboxing. Um, so this is night one of two nights of unboxing. Um, I know, right? That is seriously pink, Corvus. You can thank Pam for this because <laughs> yes. I, because I, Pam's fault. Yeah, it is totally <laughs> Pam's fault because the the blue miners helmet um, that I took a photo of that I posted on social media wasn't actually mine. My <laughs> there's, see, there's Pam. Um, it wasn't actually mine. My mom had purchased them for her friend Kristen's two sons. She got a red one and a blue one, so I put the blue one on to um, hi Kim to take the photo, but then Pam commented that it didn't match our branding, and then I noticed that she was absolutely correct, so I, I made my mother go back, all the way back to a gem show so I could get a <laughs> pink one. And I think and, it was well worth yeah. it. How but about y'all? It, it really is like... It's a good thing you have glasses to I keep it I was going to say, the only thing that's <laughs> keeping it from completely falling down is my glasses. Because it has an adjuster thing in here, but it doesn't... Doesn't seem to be. I mean, adjusty. It well, it just doesn't seem to be staying adjusted. I mean, I don't know what you know. This this five dollar child's toy miner's helmet is is not acting like a, a couture chapeau. I wonder why. That is, it's, it's it's a mystery. It is. It's a mystery. It's puzzling. But anyway, um, but hi Corvus and Lori and Silver and Silver and, and, Pam. and Pam and Kim and everyone yes hi everybody cheers to all of you welcome to the beating dreams unboxing stream okay so right i should i should get a i should get like a beating dreams decal made for the side of it you should oh that was a nail fail uh oh that's all right well i'm gonna glue my nail back on while i'm telling y'all okay <laughs> look at that it's it's hat hair <laughs> Hey, Susan. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Cindy and Susan. <laughs> All right, so welcome to the Beating Dreams unboxing stream where I'm going to... Wow, that is some serious hot air I have going on right now. Wait, it's what really is this cute. thing that's going on? Um, yeah, so welcome to the... I mean, this... Just embrace the I know, chaos right? hair. Shiny, embrace the chaos <laughs> hair, right? Shiny things and booze. It's true, Silvern. Okay, so it's the Beating Dreams live un unboxing stream night one of two. So I'm going to be literally pulling out of the boxes... And bags all of the merchandise that I purchased at this year's Denver conglomeration of gem shows well wow, I am so much shorter than you yeah <laughs> I, I think that I your feel stool, like I, I feel like I need a booster seat <laughs> I feel like really I should be sitting on that stool and you should be sitting on this and it would even it out because you're not this much shorter <laughs> I feel, I feel I mean, you are when we're standing up, but I, I, don't I feel have like that I should be a person. member of the lollipop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, so tomorrow maybe we switch. Maybe we switch. <laughs> so, all right. So this is not a sale per se, but <laughs> it is your first opportunity <laughs> to see the new merchandise that I brought back from Denver, and you can claim things off of the unboxing. Um, if you ask for pricing, sometimes I will be able to um, throw you the price off the top of my head. Sometimes we'll just have to make a pile for you and get back to you tomorrow on Discord or Facebook or Whispers, however. So you can claim things. Or text. Or text. Like, you know, we have a, oh my God, when I was at the show, it was oh. like, <laughs> how, many, how many communication streams can I try to manage at once? And then I've got my mom, like, Ba 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 in my ear while I'm trying to <laughs> look at Discord, Facebook messages, text messages. <laughs> like, I God help anybody who whispered me while I was in in Denver because I didn't even check those. But it's just like, <laughs> I mean, I just it's like there was just circus music playing in the bath background. It's like <laughs> I <laughs> exactly, <laughs> and I'm like picturing myself juggling like 15 cell phones <laughs> to the music. Like it's crazy. It's like I need to a, the music. That's impressive. Yeah. Well, I'm a dancer. Well, yeah. 
Um, but, but yeah, you are not a juggler. <laughs> I'm not a juggler. I've tried to teach myself to juggle a couple of times. I, I, I've never stuck with it long enough to get it. I can spin poi. I bet you could throw cell phones. You mean I'm just supposed to throw cell phones at my mother? That's what I was supposed to be doing? Yes. <laughs> you should have taken extras. Right. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, it was nuts. So why are you pelting me with candy that has Xanax in it? <laughs> right. No, no reason. No reason. <laughs> oh my God. What, uh, and one of the times I didn't say this, but I was so close when she was so out of control being like, if you do not calm the F down, I'm going to force feed you a Xanax. I did not say that to my mother. We need to make her a calm down close. jar for travel. Right? Okay, so. Yeah. You can clean things off of the unboxing. We'll put them aside for you. Like hey, I Jim. said. Hi, Jen. <laughs> um, like I said, if I know the prices off the top of my head, I will I will shop them at you. If I don't know the prices, we'll get back to you tomorrow. Um, and this is unboxing day one of two. Okay, I had three boxes. So I've got a box and a half tonight and then a box and a half tomorrow of cool stuff. And um, it's been long enough that I don't remember what the heck is in all of these things. So let's, oh God. <laughs> I tell you that. <laughs> right meow. Yeah. Right? Um, yeah, we could all use a good calm down jar. Seriously. Maybe that's a freeform Friday. Right? <laughs> Also, I'm still getting the Denver out of my sinuses, so I may start just randomly sneezing. Um, it's true. Or I might. During tonight's broadcast, so... Because I promise that... The Denver came back on the boxes. It did, exactly. <laughs> hey, Rosemary! <laughs> Hi, Rosemary! We missed we you, you so you much, too. I missed you guys all so very much. And I mean, I'm... Tally Fett missed us so much, she commuted with us on Friday. I know, that's amazing. Yeah, it was so great. <laughs> yes, and I, so I think... Um, I will try and follow up with everybody who claimed things while I was at the show over the next couple of days. Heather's got, I handed Heather a bunch of stuff with people's names on it, so we'll try and, um, no, it's totally done for, um, I did, I did actually take a Rona test this morning since I had been traveling and on a plane and everything, and, and it's clear, so no, it's just frickin' pollen. Boo. I had an allergy migraine on Monday night. I did too. Tuesday we night. both did. Tuesday night. Hi, Lee. Yeah, Lee. Lee, unfortunately, does not have allergies. Lee failed that test. <laughs> yes. Might also have allergies. I'm sure. Yeah. But, um, all right, so without further ado, let's <laughs> start with the unboxing. We're past. <laughs> no, <laughs> no one is too old for cute fair earrings. That's the truth. It's true. So let's start with, um, so the gummy Speaking bears. Speaking of. <laughs> so, Jen, I did pull the two peach-colored gummy bears for you. Um, shockingly, the gummy bears were a huge hit, which I Shocking. was not quite expecting. So, I have more gummy bears on the way. We um, Oh, no! Oh, I'm so sorry, Silver. That sucks. Um, How so, are you yeah. feeling now? So, as far as gummy bears go, um, I have the... Okay, I need to not, like, tip that over. But it needs to be within arm's reach. So, <laughs> thanks, Linda. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Well, that's um, good news, Silvern. Yes. Okay, so so these are Pave CZ gummy bears. Um, all of the enamel gummy bears are gone. They have all sold. I actually accidentally double sold some of them. So I have more gummy bears that will be... I it, So many message streams. I know. <laughs> I was, that wasn't a judgy look. <laughs> that's just because I have bangs. That's fair. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, so all the enamel gummy, gummy bears at the moment are sold out, but I will be getting more. But I do have these three adorable little pave, um, completely pave on the front there, not pave on the back. But I've got three little pave gummy bears still available if anybody is feeling gummy berry. They are $14.50? No. They're not. They're... Twelve fifty. Okay, then I will change those bags yesterday. <laughs> what you're expecting me to remember what I did? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, there there were flasks. I did bring a flask. Okay, but here's the um. Okay, so one gummy bear for Rosemary. Got it. Here's the thing about my mom, is she just um twelve fifty Corvus. She just stares and watches me all the time, all the time. So so taking a nip from my flask, literally the only chances that I got were when she was in the bathroom. 
Um, and also, she didn't make you watch her pee. No, Uno gummy for Corvus. And also, by the way, she flatly refused to let me buy any gemstone penises. So, so Sally Fett, if you're gonna be in Tucson, I think I'm just gonna slip you a couple hundred dollars and have you do the penis shopping for me because that was a, that was a solid no fly. <sighs> She didn't let you out of her sight because she was afraid there would be penile. <laughs> right? Right? Exactly. Mm. Well, it's not that... Well, no love. I, I mean, they were right on the table, but the thing is, like, you know, if I went over and picked them up and, <laughs> and purchased them, she, she just, literally Jen, she said no. We don't sell practical things. We don't sell practical things. <laughs> I'm sorry, there are no gem peens. There are other cool <laughs> gems, though. So, continuing on. Um, also, we have kitty cats. We have oh, little... cats. Yes. Oh, Tally Fett, you have no idea. Ooh. I would, um, I'm coming to love you even more than I already do. That's, that's difficult, <laughs> but possible, I suppose. Okay, so I also have little gemstone. Oh my goodness, Linda, did you see these? No, because they, I don't think I showed them to her yesterday. <laughs> what job <down> is <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, all right, these are little CZ Poverty Panther Heads. There are black ones with green eyes and there are brown ones with green eyes. The brown ones have black rhodium and the black ones have gold rhodium. And I've got, what do I have? Two, four. Oh, and there's gold and silver in the black. So there's four gold panthers and four silver panthers and four brown panthers. So I have, I've got a pack of panthers and these are beads. They've got a hole right there. And the panthers are... 750 for the Panthers. <laughs> Don't worry, no nobody's comparing anybody to gemstone phalluses. Just saying. Uh okay, two Oh my. Okay. Alright. Hi everybody. <laughs> it's good to know you all are awake. Yes. Alright, two black kitties in silver for silver. That's a shock. Right? Uh two uh, Linda, do you want black and gold? I'm assuming you want black and gold. The black and gold look more you. And then two silver panthers for Tally Fett. That means we are sold out of silver panthers, silver and black. So we have two silver and gold remaining and four brown remaining. So um, Corvus missed out on a panther and uh, Susan and Lori. So. Um, Okay, Lori will take black and gold if that's what's left. There we go. Susan will pass. Corvus, I'm sorry, you are you are pantherless because I don't think the brown ones are really your your cup of tea. They're awesome though. They are awesome. It might be my cup of tea. Well, and so I'll see if I can get more panthers when I get more gummy bears. Linda okay. and Lori. Linda, Lori, and Talifat. Talifat. <clears throat> okay, what's in this bag? Oh, right. Cool stuff. So, um, I have the tentacle ring. Nobody has claimed the tentacle ring yet. Um, it is a sterling silver ring. And it's, oh, it makes a heart. I didn't realize it makes a heart. It's like, it's like oh. tentac tentacly love. So, we have our tentacle love. Don't search that without safe it's, search on. Yeah, unless you know what you're getting into. Um, so, I've got one tentacle ring. This is sterling silver, and um, it's $96 for the tentacle ring. Let's see, what else is in here? <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, I've got hearts, and I've got calves. I've got labradorite, I've got eyes. Okay, cool stuff in here. Okay, well, vamp for a second, because I'm still catching up from all of... <laughs> You're still catching up from the panthers? I... <laughs> panthers are fast, look. <laughs> <laughs> Panthers are also stealthy. Oh, okay, so I can tell a story. So, yes. <laughs> okay, so Ziggy, as most of you know, is a very temperamental kitty, and he's been having some behavioral problems. Um, and so I decided that I was going to lock, because he's an indoor-outdoor cat, because that's what works best for his temperament. So I decided I was going to lock him inside. I was going to lock the cat door while I was gone. He and maybe had plenty of food, plenty of water. The air conditioning was on, like... You know, everything was fine. And I blocked 
the cat door with a box of cement. And on Saturday morning, my neighbor sends me that photo. That is Ziggy. Not inside not any inside house. Any house. Yeah, so <clears throat> he and Mamie, I'm pretty sure they tag teamed it. Uh, they staged a jailbreak. They managed to knock over the box of concrete that was blocking the cat door. And then they managed to paw the lock lever to the let us out position. I'm pretty sure that Mamie was the brains of that operation and Ziggy was the brawn. Yes. I'm, I'm fairly certain. That because Ziggy has brawn and, and Mamie has brains. Wait, exactly. They're like pinky in the brain. Yep. So, right. so yeah. So, <laughs> so then they were free. I know, right? <laughs> so then, then they were free and, and then, um, yeah. Excuse you, Mom. I'm going to eat on the front sidewalk. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it, it was like, oh, crap. <laughs> I did not. I, I almost texted my neighbor, neighbor what a little shithead, but I figured that was maybe a little rude, so I, I went with what a stinker instead. <laughs> but that was drinking before nine. Uh, I mean, uh, that, that was, was cursing before cursing nine. Cursing before nine. Yes. Which leads We're to drinking before nine. We're definitely drinking before nine. Golly. Okay, so I got some cool iPod pendants. Um, I got Next some... time there needs to be concrete on the outside. Right, seriously. Um, so I have these cool eye pendants and um, I'm only going to get one out of the bag. But I think these are really cool because they are... Yes, that he is did, He did not lining. bite anyone, it's true. Um, but they're, so they're eye pendants and they actually have these really cool realistic looking glass eyes, which I think are really fun. I know some people find them creepy, so if you are one of those people, I'm sorry to be creeping you out on stream. Um, it won't last creepy. very long, but yeah, so I've got, um, I've got a one, at least not with eyes. Yeah. I've got a green we might eye, creep you out with something else. right. I've got a green eye. I've got, this one's more like a hazel colored eye. And then I have, um, one gold colored Hamsa mm. with the, with the golden eye. It's and a movie. yes. And then this cool one, um, which is a light green. The one thing about this manufacturer is they make a lot of these where the the irises are actually pink, and that creeps me out. I can see that. I can't. I can't do the pink iris eyes for Not all. Not super into albinism. Um, I don't have two, Rita, but you can have the one hazel eyeball. They didn't have any pairs. They actually were really sold down on eyeballs. Which is the, the one I called hazel was the this one. That one. Okay. Yeah. Um, and hi, Rita. Hi, Rita. No red eyes. I'm sorry. The red eyes creep me out. Um, for all my dead dead stuff people, we have Orthoceras. These are pretty cool. They're like Orthoceras pendulums. What's the plural of pendulum? It's pendulums, right? Yes. Okay. So Orthoceras pendulums. They're That's actually awesome. pretty cool. Yeah. I love this shape. So I've got four of those. Let's see. This what's in this bag Th this is how it goes like there's like bags and bags and boxes like and my like eyeball craziness okay well at least your two eyeballs are still in your head so we didn't actually steal your eyeball <laughs> oh I get this adorable little parcel of amethysts isn't it cute and I thought I lost it but in fact I just tucked it in with some other stuff um the let's... pendulum the pendulums are, um, that's what I paid for them, so you can do the math. Okay, so 44. There we go. Um, let's see, Tally Fat, you get right of first refusal for the cabochon sets, because I did get them for you. So I've got um, one cabochon set in, sorry, in Mahogany Obsidian. I'll try to, I mean, I'm trying to not take forever on these, but they don't really look as good in the bag. So I've got one set of Teardrops Mahogany Obsidian Cabochons. That doesn't help. Um, I've got one set of, um, these are, these are Fossil Coral, so these are Dead Stuff Cabochons. Oh. <coughs> Sorry, is it is it time for us to get on stream? No, it's time to throw snowballs. What? In the game. Oh. 
Got it. Um, and beat up on Medusa. Got it. No. Oh, come on. Whatever. What did Medusa do? Um, you want the Mothwing ones, Talifet? She has the power of lightning in her, her fingertips. I think you should recruit her to your side, not beat up on her. Well, I don't These have that turquoise. option. It's not that sophisticated. <laughs> These are turquoise <laughs> composite. It's a free game, okay? Um... <laughs> Okay, these I meant to... Okay, Moth Wings this is, this is, this is, are going for Talifet. Um, these I meant to research, and I didn't, because they called them something like a Apache Gold. And I, I, I wanted to see what the origin of that was, because it definitely seems a little racist. <laughs> um, so these I did not get a chance to research, so I don't know what they actually are. I mean, they look like... Betroidal hematite on top of matrix rock. Damn. It's a chlorite schist with chalcopyrite. Okay. So at least they're not calling them well, okay, chalcopyrite is also sometimes known as fool's gold. It's a high-grade copper ore. So, I guess if you're underground, pyrite and chalcopyrite right. look like. Yeah, so that's the that's the matrix rock underneath, and then I guess that's um, chalcopyrite. It's the trade top. name given to an elegant black and shiny metallic gold rock found in the United Verde Mine in Jerome, Arizona. Okay. Or Jeremy. I don't know how so, to pronounce that. <laughs> so I've got two. I've got a <laughs> pair of teardrops, and then I this I thought was really cool. This is it's essentially a circle, but it's two two half circles. Those are really awesome. So yeah, they are really cool. I meant I to research them more before I got on stream, but then I forgot. But that's okay. I have the power of Google right here. Ooh. Let's see. These are seraphonite. Mm. They are very cool. Um, let's see. Okay, these calves. <laughs> these just need to go with all the eyeballs, and then we're set. Right. Okay. Um, these calves are already spoken for. Um, I've got Should I put them in a bag for Molly Kid? Okay. Um, I got skulls. They're they're just skulls. They're not drilled or anything, but I do have skulls. They're very narrow skulls. It's like they got smooshed a little bit. Didn't get dropped on their head when they were a kid, but they got smushed between, you know, a, a car door or something. <laughs> Who hasn't been? Um, if anybody likes One fire skull. agate, I got some tiny, tiny little fire agates, which are super cute. If anybody likes fire agate. Okay. <laughs> I'm feeling judged here. Not judged. You're not judged for getting the fire agate. You're That's judged the price a little. For three of them. Okay. You might be judged a little bit for it. They're 33 Corvus, and that's discountable. They are so cute. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, Ruby Zoocyte teardrops, matched pair. Um, oh, that one's mine. <coughs> oh, and that's for Essie because it's a fish. Um, Larvakite calves. No, not Larvakite. Those are more fossil corals. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, Denise. Um, yeah, so Larvakite, not Larvakite. This is for Essie. Yeah, that's yeah. for Essie. Um, yeah, so fossil coral calves and... Um, these are cool. These are blue calcite calves, which I love. I love the actual like, landscape look. Of those. Those are gorgeous. Um, more dead stuff. I got two cool fossil coral calves, um, a triangle and an oval, and I liked it because you can really see the little dead critters in there, which is fun. Oh, there's another molly cab. Okay. And then molly I kid molly cab. Yep. And then I did. I and I know that Robin, among others, were shocked by this, but I did get some hearts because hearts were everywhere, and when you make them out of pretty rocks. They're, they're, they're more attractive. Yes. So, so this one is um, a cool mica heart, and this one I have no freaking clue. I oh, think this is one's African really jade. Cool. Um, 
and that one's really pretty as well, African Jade Heart. Um, Tallyfoot claimed a Labradorite Heart, but I still have two Labradorite Hearts available. They are really pretty. And this is actually Larvakite, so Larvakite Heart. And then I got some really kick-ass, um, really kick-ass um, Labradorite calves as well. Whoa. Look at that blue flash. What? So I've got an oval. It's like a sapphire. Dude. I know. I've got an oval, and I also have a teardrop. Jenny, I already picked one for you. Lab heart for <laughs> silver. And got it? No, Susan, they're not drilled. The hearts are all just cabochon. How much is the teardrop? That's a good question, Corvus, that I don't have the answer to because I don't have a scale back here. Um, let me see. Mine is... Um, Alright, Heather's going to see if she has a scale available. And then I can tell without you how much it is. Overturning the rest yes, of without my... overturning everything on her workstation. I am afraid the answer is no, but I also know how it works. Okay, so I will wait. Hi, Alicia! Oh my god! Okay, Alicia, I have been trying to get in touch with you, and I swear to god. My phone has eaten all of our message streams and everything, but hold on. Can you grab that tray of pink amethyst drops that's on the table? Because you wanted one of these, and I found a strand that was broken, and then I couldn't figure out how to get in touch with you because I am not always good with that. But, um, Alicia, you wanted, at one point, you wanted some of these, right? These giant pink amethysts? Yes. Because I have some. I found a broken strand. So we missed you! We're yes. so glad to have you back. But if you want one of those, um, Just let, let me know. know. Okay, so it's 9.4 grams. Now there must be... Yes. Yay! Yes! Woohoo! Awesome. Alright, so tell me how many you want and I will pick them for you and I will get you a price. Um, and now I'm going to do math. So, um, informational rant for anybody who doesn't know. Um, so, one gram equals five carats. That's carat with a C. So we were talking about... And not two R's. Right. Um, so when you're talking about weight of a gemstone, it's carat with a C. When we were talking about quality of gold, it's carat with a K. Um, and uh, one gram equals five carats. That means you have to be careful if you're used to shopping for things that are sold by the gram and then all of a sudden you wind up shopping <laughs> things that are sold by the carrot you're like, that's how much <laughs> well and then funny story There's a zero on that <laughs> um and just to show that it still happens to me i actually had a somewhat embarrassing incident at the show where i found these beautiful gemstones they were synthetic they were lab grown it was this super darling Russian gal, probably about my age, um, who had a whole booth of synthetic gemstones. And she was really fun, really chatty. Um, thank you. Thank you, darling. I love you. Um, my mom was actually wearing a giant um, piece of rough Chatham created sapphire, which got so many compliments. And it's an amazing piece. Um, but her, her boxes were marked, I thought they were marked price for the stone, and they weren't. They were marked price per carat. So I'm like, oh, I'll take this one and this one and this one and this one and this one. And then she adds them all up. And she's like, okay, that's like $3,000. I'm like, oh, okay, maybe not. Maybe I won't take any of those. But um, so it does still happen to me. It's okay, well. Tally Fett. It's okay to ask questions and it's okay to be wrong. And this lab, Corvus, is $190. But that is discountable. Okay, going on. This can go in here, and... Tally Fett, maybe we're just saving you from yourself, but right? I don't want you to be at that job right now, because <laughs> I'm mad at it. Oh, we're mad at Tally Fett's job? Only temporarily, I okay. think. Okay. Alright, that bag is empty. Woo! Woo! Do you need me to put it in the bag then? Um, oh my god, that's heavy. Oh, uh, oh. 
and it's also stuck. <laughs> okay, so all right, we're gonna we're gonna start going through things a little faster here now, cause um, oh dear. And and we're not gonna get through everything, but no. um, don't forget we are having again we're having another unboxing night tomorrow night, six thirty to seven thirty ish. I can guarantee you we're not gonna end at seven thirty tonight, and um, then we're doing a a, a proper sale um, of the live merch live merchandise. Um, yay! Well, we're so glad. But yeah, we're gonna do a proper merchandise sale on Saturday night. Um, but so I'm just sure. going to kind of flip through these pretty quickly. If you see something you want, um, comment and I will go back to it. But um, purple sapphire, so pretty. Mm. Um, 8 millimeter faceted rounds. <coughs> I did stock the hell up on tiny shinies because I know we needed them. Mm -hmm. Including, look at these. Uh, see, that's why she's on this uh, side of the screen. These are 4 millimeter pyrite cubes they're ridiculous they are ridiculous they're adorable okay purple Denise. sapphire for denise got it um uh, also tiny room tiny room cubes anybody need some some discreet room these are so <laughs> cute so yeah tiny room cubes four millimeter garnet cubes um cubes price um so all of the cubes are gonna be in the range one pyrite cubes for susan So figure all the cube strands are going to be in the range of $32 a strand. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, Alicia, but that, that auto press was pretty hilarious. It's very cute. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Tally Fett, Pyrite, four millimeter cubes. Look how cute they are. There's several strands of those. Um, so the purple sapphire out of the bag is looks like okay, that. Is it all right with you if I turn down the air just a little bit? Oh please, I'm dying. Yeah, okay. you're fine. <laughs> I can see that it's almost at eighty. Yeah. Did we never turn it down today, or did somebody just turn it up out of spite? Um, it was at like seventy six, so it might have gotten nudged down, but nudged up. Yeah. Um, so purple sapphires, and those are one thirty-five for the strand. <laughs> one pyrite cubes for Corvus, and one pyrite. You got the one pyrite cubes for, for Susan, Susan right? Davis. Yes. Do you need a scissor? I do need These a scissor. Metal shears right there. But this is for hair cutting. You almost made me spit my champagne out. That's not nice, Heather. You're not supposed to be funny while I'm drinking. I'm sorry. I You're didn't... only supposed to be funny when I'm not drinking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, continue. On. So I've sold three strands of the pyrite cubes. Yes. Um, no. Yes. Yes. Tally Fett, Corvus, and Susan. Um, All right. We also have the tiny cubes in Sunstone. And if there's another one, maybe I will. Okay, I got a crap ton of these because I had a feeling about them, so people don't prove me wrong. These are black. Stay there. These are black spinel, um, four millimeter faceted prisms. So they are teeny tiny little black spinel faceted prisms. They are pretty much the cutest thing ever. I got 15 strands of them. I... <sighs> They're even cuter than they were in my head. <laughs> and, oh my gosh. Um, and these are, let's see. I just, I want like a collar made of them. Um, these guys are going to be, yes. Yeah, so the baby prisms are going to be $22 a strand for the black spinel baby prisms. They yeah. are just so freaking cute. So I, I got, I got a bunch of them. So um, one for Susan, one for Tally Fett. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Okay. I mean, I still have thirteen left. Uh, 
All right, continue. I mean, not when I'm through with them, but. Well, you know, I mean, I figured one for Sheena. Sheena, by the way, is an amazing human, one, which you all two, know. One, two, three, four. Okay. Um, she brought us booze and caffeine and lemonade and tea today because she is an angel among women. And we um, all knew this. But... We all knew this, but she continues to prove it and get better and better. So cheers, Sheena. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. Yes, that blood orange lemonade was ridiculously good. Yes, I made sure that Heather got the blood orange lemonade. And it was the prettiest color, too. It was. Of all the lemonades. It's gone now because it went down my gullet, but... Which is good. That's that's where lemonade is supposed to go. Okay, so continuing on with some tiny shinies. We, sorry. Nope. Choices were made. <laughs> were, were they bad choices? Um, so far, they're going less smoothly than they could have. <laughs> Fair. Okay, so um, we've got some cool pink tourmaline, tiny shinies, ruby light tourmaline. Rubylite is the name for red tourmaline as, uh, did we get? Got Silvern. Yeah, Silvern, we got you. Got Susan, got Talifet, got Silvern, got Sheena. So if there's anybody out there who claimed prisms whose name Heather didn't just say, um, shout out in the chat. I really feel like I need a booster seat. <laughs> 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 You're just so short, <laughs> and I'm sitting up straight. I'm not slouching. I'm slouching so you. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> okay, there's also I um there was a new shape that I got in a couple of different stones that um it's just this fat faceted rondelle which I really like, and um, so I got that fat faceted rondelle in fluorite, and I got it in. Tiger Eye, which I don't think Carol has seen yet. They got Tiger Eye. Oh. And I think there's a couple more. They're kind of buried in the bottom there. Um, I got Tourmaline, Multicolor Tourmaline Rondelles. These are super pretty. I was going to say, speaking of buried in the bottom, and then I decided maybe I shouldn't just <laughs> say that where anyone could clip it. Yeah, right? <laughs> which, by the way, I so I um, edited my first video with like music and, and like titles and things that I'll probably be posting um, on social media tomorrow. So one of the cool things that I got to see, um, tourmalines are, can you do the math on that for me while I'm uh -huh. talking? Um, so one of the cool things that I got to see at the show, which I've never actually seen before, is um, them actually, Heather's doing the math on the tourmaline rondelles, but actually 43. $43 a strand for the tourmaline rondelles. And we've got, I think, four strands, five strands, probably four strands. So I actually got to see them four strands. take a seven foot tall sodalite obelisk and lift it up onto a four foot tall, four, you know, three foot square sodalite pedestal. Um, the strands are 16 inches long, Susan. One strand for Alicia. Um, and it was, it was amazing. Uh, like, obviously they did it with a forklift and there was like all kinds of, you know, getting, getting it up, getting it aligned, getting it down and then getting the tie downs out and getting it level. Like it was, it was insane just watching them do this and like how cool it was to actually see this done and some finesse with a forklift. Hey Dan, I know seriously. And then at the very end of the process, like to get the tie down out from underneath, they actually took the forklift forks and and brought them down over the top of the obelisk and and put shims in so it didn't crack the stone. And then um, they literally turned the forklift just to tilt the obelisk enough that they could get the tie down out. Like, it was insane. Alicia, the amethysts are actually by the... There's $3 a carat. Mm -hmm. So I can send you pictures with prices Tomorrow. after. Yeah. yeah. If that's okay with you. So it was amazing to watch. And it took, honestly, for like from start to finish, from like the obelisk being on the ground to being on the pedestal, took only took like 30 minutes. Which, considering that you're dealing with, and I asked, and the gentlemen were super nice, 
I asked them a bunch of annoying questions at the end of their of their labors and they answered them all and they even consented to take a picture in front of the obelisk um, but yes um, 3,800 pounds approximately is what that obelisk weighed and if anybody is in the market for a seven foot tall obelisk on top of a four foot tall pedestal of sodalite that can be yours for the bargain price of two hundred and twenty thousand dollars so yeah is that all that's it you know like How you do. There was a pair of them. 2,200,000. 2,200,000 is actually, yeah, what the gentleman told me. So so I'm interpreting that to mean 220,000. Seems seems like the right number of zeros. Hey, that's mine. I know, but I want... It's free. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they had two, Corvus. There was a pair. There was a pair. Oh, it's so pretty. Sorry, we've lost uh, Heather. So we've lost Heather. <laughs> um, okay, so let's go on with this bag of stuff. We've got one strand of Labradorite cool um, Rondelli things. Uh, that's some really nice Labradorite. It's got some really... They're like Rondel bicones. Yes. It's cool. Um, I've got turquoise Rondels. These are genuine turquoise. Mm -hmm. I have Hessenite. You better get them before Heather does. Just saying. Um, these are... Did anyone see that look of greed in my eyes? <laughs> um, these are sapphire, I think. Sapphire, four millimeter cubes. Ooh. Um, but yeah, so I'll post that, I'll post that video on the, on the interwebs tomorrow. I, um, I'm pretty Actually, proud. Do you want to just hand me the white bag and I'll put these in that? That works. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with my, I mean, it's not perfect. But it's the first video I've ever edited to this it's very degree, cute. so I'm very, I'm very proud of myself. I am too. Not proud of myself, proud of you. Nobody judge me. Um, oh, so Indicolite Blue Tourmaline. There was a bunch of blue tourmaline around, including these adorable 4mm blue tourmaline coins. Um, I got several strands of those because I knew Heather was going to steal one. And these are... Me? Yeah, you. These are about 60 Could feet be. a strand. <clears throat> <laughs> there were no cookies in the cookie jar. How much for the sapphires? I'm Susan looking for those. Oh, those sapphires are not. Those go back. Um, were they in your hair? No, the ones for. Geez. Got it. Um, actually, twenty four for I, sapphires. I, I like sapphires. It's like it's very Gaelic, <laughs> right? <laughs> So hires. <laughs> like it. Okay, so um, So yes, they're 44. Uh so also lapis, tiny shinies, and these are cool. These are the um they call them eagle eye or hawk's eye. They're basically tiger eye that's been dyed black, but they are a really great stone for the men folks. Uh, I have agates, probably gonna break those up. If anybody wants a single one of those. Um, green. There was a lot of tourmaline. So there's green tourmaline. That's kyanite, not tourmaline, but kyanite. One black tiger eye for Denise. The black tiger eye Corvus would like the price of. Working on We should bring a calculator back here tomorrow. No, oh, I have a calculator over there. Um, also, watermelon tourmaline, tiny cubes. And ruby, tiny cube. 52 for the black tiger. One for Denise. I need to write that number down. Um, these are, these are shungite. 10 millimeter round shungite, which is a good stone metaphysically. These are, oh, these are the, the tiny prisms. But, oh, what? See? Hashtag Heather React. <laughs> These are the tiny prisms in, or no, tiny cubes. No, prism. Prisms. Prisms. Tiny prisms in kyanite. Tiny cubes in tourmaline. The price is. Uh, 44. 
Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Aren't they so pretty? And they're so cute. So yeah, we got tiny prisms and kyanite. So I wouldn't yeah, like I them. Spent, I'm not gonna. There's Sharpie on there. I spent a dumb one for Susan. I spent a dumb amount of money on tiny shinies, y'all. Like, no, I think you spent a good amount of money on it. My mom was like, do we have enough tiny shinies? I was like, no, more tiny shinies. No, because we keep putting them on stream and then we have none for six months. Right, exactly. Um, okay, so here's that new shape again uh, in Lapillite, those big honkin' rondelles. They're so fun. And these these were on uh, the the Insta and the Facebooks. These are pink tourmaline bicones. And okay, so hold on. So those are two millimeter cubes, and these are three millimeter cubes. So they are slightly less tiny, but still tiny. What are what are you, my precious thing, Talifet? All of the things. Because they're all That's small fair. and um, Labradorite rondelles, four millimeter faceted rondelles of Labradorite. Um, more kyanite. Oh, the two millimeter are too small. Do you want the three millimeter instead, Susan? Where did I put them? There we go. Here. I can I can do a size comparison. Maybe. open the zip lock. See, I, I heard you, Tally, that I heard that's what was happening. Why can I not open a Ziploc bag? It's part of my job. <laughs> well, those are non-standard. It's true. I think she ran out of the standard ones. Okay, so here's a size comparison. So these are the two millimeters. These are the three millimeters. I can use my hand for scale. Without a left index for what did you do, Susan? Again? Did did you What did you do? Right, that one goes back to you. Okay, okay, so three millimeter for Susan instead. And the price on those is uh fifty wait. Because the other ones were forty four. Okay. What's the math on that? 50. 50. Okay. Well, you sounded tentative. <laughs> you didn't sound sure. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dear. Okay. Ow. One of those for Susan. Yeah. Yeah. When you, when you have an interrogative lift at the end of the number, it makes me doubt your sincerity. <laughs> Sorry. Look, there's a lot of pressure. I'm hot and there's math. I enjoy math, but I don't enjoy hot. We should bring your fan over here for tomorrow. Or just turn it. Okay, so more blue tourmaline. Poor thing. I'm so sorry, Susan. That sucks. Ugh. Alright, more blue tourmaline rondelles. I love blue tourmaline. And I know I can always sell it to Heather, so I tend to, to purchase it with abandon. Um, Hassanite. I need a tape. I do not have a tape back here. I need to sneeze as well, so I'm going to sneeze and get a tape. <laughs> I'm, sh I'm sure, Susan, that wasn't the word you used. I'm sure the word you used would um, have us drinking before nine. Bless you. Thank you. While you're up, is there more champagne? Yes. It's well, refill can, time. Can you? I can. Tape while yes. I refill? Yes. Yeah, so it's taken, like, <laughs> that's actually even, Susan, that's a little bit more tame than what I think I would have said, because <laughs> mine would have started with mother and ended with ucker, and, <laughs> such a nice sound. <laughs> mother stucker. <laughs> right. Okay, there are Susan's, they are taped. It's before nine. I know, but I don't have any drink. That's what Heather is fixing right now. She is rectifying the situation. Of the of Oops, the lack. I tripped. I'm sorry. It's okay. I tripped on your pristine surface. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay, so now we're about. Let's see, we're about to get into the CZ Pave. Um. Oof. 
which I also spent a significant amount of money on, but a few more tiny shinies before we get to that. Sorry, give me a moment. Heaven needs a moment. I do. I'm running out of stories. Oh, but yeah, it's taken a solid couple, three days for the, for the Denver to, and it's still there in my sinuses. I don't have an excuse. Well, you're right. It came there. On, it came on the boxes. The, the Denver did come. It arrived here, and it's been plaguing us ever since. Yes. Because yeah, right, I can't okay. read. Okay, more tiny shinies. There's some Amazonite, and these are Corundum. So these are Sapphire and Ruby. Those are really cool. Corundum 4mm rondelles. Those are really cool. Isn't it pretty, Pam? I love that shirt of Heather's. He's so pretty. Thank you. Um, these are golden mica, which is really cool. Um, it's got... Mica's cool because it's got this, like, soft sheen to it. It's not a super high polished stone because it's not a super hard stone. But, yeah, I love... I really you, wish Mom you, had gotten more of that. Are you fondling the mica? A little. I mean, mica's so pretty. How much for the Corinna Rondells? I did manage to get some Malachite. Those are 10 millimeter. I got some fluorite in the tiny cube size. 81. For Corundum Rondells. Fluorite Tiny Cube, super fun. You go in there. Oh! Wow, I didn't actually splash outside the glass. That's amazing! <laughs> <laughs> I get extra points. <laughs> um, but just to be safe, I should have some. Right? Petersite Tiny Cubes and Sunstone Rondelles. Oh my gosh, look at the Peter site! I know, aren't they amazing? <laughs> it's um, rude, is what it is. It's <laughs> what the hell are these? It's vanilla, I think. Still before nine. It's gonna be before nine for the entire stream. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are spinel rondelles. Yes, ma'am. Really pretty. Sheena, do you need us to hold both strands or one strand? And then, once again, like I said, blue tourmaline. You're going to love it. Yeah, you really are. And blue mm -hmm. tourmaline, again, was everywhere. So I got some 8mm faceted blue tourmaline strands. And, Sheena, if you love it and don't want to love an entire strand, I can help. <laughs> Heather is throwing herself on the grenade. I am just that good to everyone. Okay, so these are, so I actually have two bags of these, because I posted these on Discord, and um, they got such a good response that I went back and I got more. Uh, but I don't know where the second bag is. It's somewhere in this stuff. So these are the original charms. So these are, um, the big ones are going to be 10. Oh, goodness. I'm going to sneeze again. Shoot. A monkey. Right now. <gasps> oh, that's you. Thank you. Oh god. So, um, yeah, so these cute little charming bits. I um, um, love them. The little basket, yes, are going to be 10, um, except for the teeny beanies, which are going to be 8, which there aren't any teeny beanies in this one, but there are in the there other There are. Bag. They're so cute. And Ooh, Tally Fett, I know that you wanted... Oh, how cool. Isn't that fun? Yeah. I know you wanted a cat Tally Fett and um, a couple other things, so I will have to go through and pull out your stuff, but there's like, there's butterflies, and there's dragons, cute little enamel dragons, there's fishes of various types, because there's another fish that's really cute that's in the other bag. Tiger, rawr. Tiger, tiger, burning bright in the forest of the night. Yes. So yeah, fun little charmy bits, and um, when I find the other other bag. I'll show that to you guys as well. Kitties and fishes for Tally Fett. Okay. So we might need to have a photo shoot with all the kitties and all the fishes so Tally Fett can pick out which one she wants. Okay. 
Okay, these are clasps. These are vermeil. So that means they are, um, oh, and a couple of eyes. In here. Because these were the same price point as the clasps. So I got these three cool eye charms. And those are going to be 15 each. And then um, these cool vermeil clasps. So some of them have genuine stone, some of them have glass. Um, They're box clasps in vermeil. Um, we've got some single strands, double strands, triple strands. Um, so these very fun claspy bits. Really, my nose needs to stop, stop. it. Yes. Also, I'm going to sneeze again, I think, in a minute. In a minute, I'm going to need a cinnamon roll. <laughs> <laughs> to pop me out. Y'all, I'm still really sad that they didn't cast Lizzo as Ursula in The Little Mermaid, because she wanted to be Ursula so badly, and she posted an audition video, and it was amazing. And she wasn't as much of a household name at that point, so they were like, oh, okay, that's cool. Clasps are 15, Corvus. And they cast Melissa McCarthy, and now Lizzo is not Ursula, which is unfortunate. Is just sad. Yes. Uh, so, Cubic Zirconia and Pavic. I got a bunch, including, but not limited, to giant clasps. Red one. Little snickies. Do you want the... Do you want the garnet? There are several red ones. So, little garnet drops. These are genuine garnet. Um, oh, That's me. Corvus, which red one do you want? Opaque or shiny? I have a feeling it's going to be shiny. I also have a feeling. Um, eyes... Snakey snakes. Yes. Snakey snakes. Um, big, colorful, round thingies. Shiny this is one. us dying of surprise. Yes. Right here. Just totally dead of surprise. Um, I also got some sparkle snakies and um, some cool lab um, set in sterling. Teardrops. It does do that. Wow, my arm looks gigantic like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I also Why have, am I doing it, it again just to right? prove that it looks um, I have the lab drops also in gold, smaller size. I've got one double sided and two singles. More garnets. little jersey connectors. I promise I will be running all this stuff through like a proper sale um, over the next week or so starting Saturday, but we're definitely not going to be able to finish it on Saturday. It also makes my hands look huge. Price of labs. Makes me know at least it's an illusion because that's not true. <laughs> Alright, Corvus wants price of labs. Brightly colored eyes. Citrus colored, orange and yellow. Uh, lots of clippy rings and hinged rings, um, charm rings, like I'm wearing on my neck right now. Oh, duh, sorry. How about I get you a more accurate price than that? <laughs> um, <laughs> Wait, that wasn't an accurate price? Are you, what? The one I was about to give, 17 and 55. And those and these okay corvus so 17 are 55 81 and 81 one silver one gold in the big size more of uh, these cool things because we did sell out of those I got so many like clippy rings and, and carabiner type things, so there's just a bunch of those. Um, we have neon eyes, these are super cute in all your bright day glow colors. More clippy rings, 
Because you always want to be able to see your evil eye. In the Even black light. in the dark. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, these are cool. These are the, uh, this is actual Mother of Pearl with the Sacred Heart. Love on those. On top of it. Um, with, I don't think that's a garden. 17 I think, that is, I think that is a CZ, but the Sacred Did Heart Did you ones are really want cool. the double-sided one, Corvus, or the, I think you want the double-sided one. What the actual heck is that? <laughs> Random things. I have no idea. It's this cone-shaped piece of rubber that was in my bag, and I have no clue where it came from. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Here's the bag for this. Okay. Yeah, I, I got nothing. Sorry. Yeah, I, I have no idea. Okay, and the last of this bag of CZ Pave, we do have rainbows. Rainbows are visions. Only illusions, rainbows have nothing to hide. So we've been told it. that was my audition song when I was little. <laughs> so we do have rainbows. I sing it in the shower a lot. Sorry, y'all. <clears throat> and then um, last of the CZ Pave is we have fishes. We have articulated fishes. Yay! Inch-looking long prism blue. Jan, can you be a little more specific? Fishes, articulated fishes. They move, they wiggle. And I got a bunch of them because I am a sucker for articulated fishes and SCs in a fish. One of those? Uh, so Heather's postulating these. Or was it Labradorite? So yeah, so we do have a bunch of articulated fishes. Don't make me feel like an idiot for buying so many of these. Before the round eye. That? What we just showed? That. Okay. Cool. Alright, and that takes care of... Oh no, there's still stuff in there. Y'all, I bought so much stuff! No wonder I have no money. That one? This one has a squished it in. Oh dear. So, just to confirm, Jan, you want the one that says you and me. me. Well, that's good that you like stuff, because damn, girl, I bought stuff. Oh, no, there they are. Oh. Um, okay, I got... I like those. Large hole pearls in all different colors. I'll put these back in this bag. I'm done. Including white. Those are just going to live there now. Oh, and this strand. I actually snaked this strand out from underneath another woman. Oh. Well, I mean, it was in my it was in my basket, and she was in love with it. I was like, too bad, mine. Gotcha. Uh, so these are large hole pearls in multicolors. I and love them. Aren't they? They're gorgeous. You're going to cut them, right? Please? I am. Okay. And this was, and Jan's actually already claimed two of these, so we need to find her a pair of these. Jan, it's a double-ended connector piece, enameled. It's really cool. So, <laughs> all right, so these, Got Alicia. these are gorgeous. <laughs> Yes, they are. Well, and I don't I don't have the pearl bag. Alicia, are you going to be on tomorrow night? Because if you're not, I'll go, I'll make Heather go get the pearl bag. Because um, this isn't the main I like how bag. we think Heather's coming back with the pearl bag. <laughs> um, okay, so these are Tahitian pearls. They are natural Tahitians. They are about um, 10 or so millimeters in a mostly a teardrop shape. And I got a good deal on this because it's a broken strand, so I am going to be selling these individually. And uh, Rosemary, one or two strands of the multi-pearls, and they're eight-inch strands, and they are large hole, just so you know. Um, but these are natural Tahitians, and they are $25 a pearl. <laughs> Heather might run away, seriously, Heather might run away with the pearl bag. I would not be surprised. 
Um, but Jan did already claim a pair of these. So I should find her a nice pair. Alright, Rosemary is taking both of the multi pearls. Well, darn it. And the price on those is. Alright, so that was when I paid for those. Okay. Okay, Jan, I will find you a good pair of these when I'm not on the air. The pearls are running away. Which is not surprising because they're round and it's a not quite flat surface. Uh, the connector, Jan, is 17. 17. Thank you. I'm almost done with this bag. Almost. Uh, chain is all that's left in that bag. So I did get some cool chain. Um, this is all plated, space metal. Um, so I got this cool um, sort of chain with these awesome engraved plaques on it. I got this textured, <laughs> textured paperclip chain. Yeah, and this one is my favorite. It's so good. It's literally a daisy chain. It's a chain that's made of little enameled cute. daisies. It, it is so freaking much. adorable. It hurts. So the daisy chain is in the neighborhood of five dollars, six dollars a foot, and the others are going to be about the same. This the big one is going to be a little bit more. Just it's bigger. Okay, I think I finally emptied one bag. Go me. Alright, can you find a place for that on like the floor or some other? Wow, that was an impressive domino effect right there. Oh, and <laughs> send that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so as I was making a, an avalanche over on my shelf, I put the bag on my keyboard, and this is what it decided to do while I was doing that. It deflated, apparently. Yeah, right. <laughs> two feet of daisy chain for Susan. Is that in the bag that yes, I put on the floor? it was, in fact, in the bag that she just put on the floor. Because sometimes I'm not very good at this, apparently. Well. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is, that's very close to being as funny as the time that Ziggy, oh my goodness. by walking on my keyboard, posted basic wire wrapping class on our class calendar, like, 25 times. On the I wrong can't day. even do that, so I actually would like to know his secret. I, I have no idea. He he was, you know, da dancing on the keyboard, and, and that's what happened. Alright. Like I said five or six dollars a foot, didn't I? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, more cool stuff, right? <laughs> price of the pearl bag. Um, so, Hassanite Garnet, always a plus. Bigger black spinels, if anybody needs something big and sparkly. And Ruby Zoocyte, tiny cubes. One of those is for Rita. I'll get Heather to pull that when she's done cutting Susan's chain. Sorry, sorry and I are having a... Well, you know, they saran wrap these things like nobody's business. Not like me. <laughs> oh, goodness. It would be really nice if I could breathe right now. I'd be so happy. Yes. Mm. 
Yeah, oxygen. It's a thing. All right, so it's 7.49. We're supposed to go to 7.30. Obviously, we're running over. Um, so we're going to go for about another, are you good for another 15, 20 minutes? Oh, heck yeah. Okay. Heck yes, I am. So we're going to go for about another 15, 20 minutes, and then don't forget, we'll be back on this channel, twitch.tv forward slash beating dream, and on Facebook Live, unboxing more stuff tomorrow night. Uh, Hi. When, <laughs> when is this for Rita? Okay. And these are for <coughs> Rosemary. And, oh, right, so I also got the chrome diopside in the tiny cubes. How cute are those? Mm. Love. Corvus says 25 minutes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm glad that Corvus. We'll see. Um, Rosemary, I did get these jade bracelets for you because I thought you might like them. So I have three of them in the 8 millimeter faceted uh, Burmese jade. If you're interested... Yes, and if you are not interested, that was my fault. But I know you always want the jade, so <laughs> it's okay. If Sorry. If you're not interested, we will, I'm sure, be able to sell them to someone else. Okay, these are cool. I'll these are, them. like I said, tourmaline. Hi, Ace. <laughs> Ace. Okay, like I said, there was tourmaline everywhere. So these oh, are. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So these are the the usually uh. they call this color variation petrol tourmaline, mm. so they're the, the kind of pukey greens and the dark topazes in the 2 millimeter cubes. So I've got several strands of those sitting on my hands of the petrol tourmaline. Okay, no jade for rosemary. That's okay. Petrol tourmaline, I've got those tiny cubes. Alright, so how many... Burmese jade, do you want, Denise? Alright, and we're gonna close out this bag with. Oh, with what? So much cool stuff. Alright, these are cool. These are coated quartz. <gasps> wow! Um, but aren't they fun? So they're they're coated quartz um, stars and Two st I've got two stars and I've got one moon. Does the moon have a hole? I feel like the moon has no hole. It so has a lot of dents. Uh, the stars have a hole across the top, but the moon does not. Um, one, they are cute. One of the jade bracelets, Denise. Okay. Um, so I've got one moon and two stars. Tallyfet wants a star. And Jen wants a star. And Corvus wants a moon. Hey, okay. we're sold out. How, how Cheers. much are those? Thank you. We sold out of the thing. And yes, on the jade bracelet for Denise. So cheers for selling out. Okay, so now we're actually going to open a box on our unboxing. Because I had, I had previously opened a box and pulled those things out. But now I am actually, I have legitimately, I have a box here. See, there's cardboard that's smashing my camera. I'm going to go ahead and actually get into a box. And then this is where it's going to get a little bit funny. Because um, my mother and I were looking for packing material. And, um, you know, they don't actually give you newspapers anymore at hotels. <laughs> so she had bought thanks Kim <laughs> wait what oh <laughs> right um, yeah so she had bought some fashion magazines um, at the airport in Dallas to read on the plane so so we we packed everything in Vogue magazine <laughs> um, incidentally though I, I'm thinking of and I have no actual concrete plans for this but I'm thinking of in 2024 leading a, a beating shopping trip slash retreat to the Tucson gem shows where we would rent a house and we would go and we would 
I would take everyone around and we would buy gemstones and beads during the day and then at night we would have open beading time with me there to help. So um, we, just, we have to find a way to keep the store running without me as well. And yeah, yeah. So would anybody be interested in something like that? I'm They've already said yes. Okay, <laughs> we've already said yes. Got it. So I need to work on that. It wouldn't be cheap though. Is the thing like? I mean, we're probably talking about like. God, I don't even know what the number would be, but I'm guessing it's going to be a thousand plus a person. So that's, that's a lot, <laughs> but um, I would like to do it. Okay, so this is why I said we need a trash bag, because my mom literally just sat on the bed and crumpled up pages from Vogue and Marie Claire and Elle, so Hermes, <laughs> anybody? I'm not showing my butt to the internet, am I? I mean, your your butt is covered in pants, so. Well, <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> And three, what she was aiming for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I meant to grab a okay. freaking exacto. Can we? What? Scroll back up. Okay, so I know. Tally Finn had a star. Tally Jen had, had a star. star. Jen had a star. Corvus, Corvus had, had a moon. moon. Thank you. You don't need to back up now. Sophia, hi! <laughs> Sophia! You're back in the U.S., right? And Sophia got some amazing beads in Greece. For the beating dreams, because she is the bomb. Oh, I did. Which I need to pay her for and figure out shipping for. Okay, so this is a really pretty flat of amethyst. And I have to figure out how this opens so I don't like. Yes! Oh my god. So pretty! Yay! Yeah. Oh my god. Glorious. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, so this is a flat of amethyst. Oh, goodness. Geode bits in this really gorgeous, really deep purple color. They're also, so pretty. An interesting story about this particular vendor, which is really fun. So, they had, um, so I posted online, uh, some of the little petite amethyst cathedrals. And um, this is a fam quite obviously a family business. And so they have this table of these little amethyst cathedrals um, for very reasonable prices. And I didn't realize it at the time, but it was actually the, the young daughter of the business owners. I think she was probably about 12, 10 or 12. And it was her table. So she was like, she came and she was helping us and she was adding everything up and, and oh, she that's actually, awesome. um, I'm pretty sure, you know, the revenue from that table was hers. I love it. So I love it. Was it was really fun. That's extra. Um, okay. So now we're into some specimens and then I am going to close out the broadcast with the opals. So don't, don't abandon us quite yet. Oh, this is one of the things I got to screw with Corvus. Hmm. It's a big Labradorite piece. Look at that. Yes. So so this is, I got a bigger one. This is the smaller of the big ones I got to screw with Corvus. So I've got one big Labradorite piece. And then somewhere in here there's a bigger Labradorite piece. More paper. More magazine. <laughs> I'm gonna throw it at my butt again. <laughs> uh, 
Well, no, because your butt's on a chair <laughs> now. Let me show us. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> oh, the Jawas wish. <laughs> I will tell you, Sophia, how much the Amethyst are in a minute. <laughs> right? Um, okay. Surprised you didn't feel the earth shake from the intake of breath. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, 50 it's more than a yeah. Oh, oh goodness, Corvus. Um, the Amethyst Sophia are fifty dollars each. <laughs> All right, what are you? Oh goodness, you are. You don't need to. Oh, but you do. You need these sle just the sleeves. <laughs> Aren't they fun? I love this shirt. They're so pretty. I can't not understand how Heather can wear that shirt around and not rip it to shreds because I would definitely rip it to shreds. Um, I haven't ripped it to shreds. I have relocated some seed beads accidentally. <laughs> not going to lie about that. Yeah. Th what the hell does that say? <laughs> Does it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Good for you. Heather positive. Can, I'm Heather positive. Heather can translate better than me. All right. So we have eyes. Lethal, lethal eyes. Tiny, They're tiny so eyes. And, and slightly bigger eyes. So these are about eight millimeter round. These are like four millimeter round eyes. So these go in the unreadable <laughs> bag. Okay. <laughs> and these go in here. <laughs> and none of the rest of oh well there's some ammonites for all my dead stuff people and those, Ace, if you don't know then <laughs> those don't have to be on stream but I think you would like those oh oh am I allowed to have all of them <laughs> well if we don't show them to the people they'll never know what they missed <laughs> Nothing, nothing, y'all. Right. And for all my dead <laughs> stuff, people, I did get some ammonites that are drilled. Ooh. I also, somewhere around here, have some ammonites that aren't drilled, but these are drilled ammonites. Oh, Heather just found a rogue Tahitian pearl. Do I get to keep it? <laughs> no. <laughs> I know, it's okay. More paper. So much paper. Yes, I know how to operate a plastic bag, I promise. No, no, plastic bags are hard. That's why they're not allowed near young people. Right? We're young people, right? Oh, those are fun. I just got those for me. Oh, those are fun. Okay, so we've got some specimens, and then we're going to do opals them. to close out the broadcast. Look, see, that's that same exact shape. But it's obvious there. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> See, I can read. Heather can read better than me. Okay, so here we have <laughs> some of those um, petite amethyst. Oh, nope. I am a total liar. Oh. This is, I, well, Corvus, you're just going to have to wait a few. You're the one who wanted us to go for 25 more minutes. This is not um, even close to being an amethyst, but it is really cool. This is a betroidal hematite specimen. I love betroidal hematite because it totally yes. just looks like shiny lava that just like froze. Like, I mean, you know, when you say the floor is lava, like this is what I think of. So yeah, one betroidal hematite specimen. That's not light because hematite. It's made of hematite. Yes, all the lumps. It's true. Oh my gosh, it's so fun to touch. Oh, okay. So these are actually. Sorry, if someone who isn't by, if, he, if someone no. who isn't me buys this. Heather has not had completely inappropriate relations with the hematite. You can see everything that's happening. She's it's, just it's all, fondling it. Yeah. It's not in my shirt this time. Yet. It's a little heavy. I feel like it would hit my feet. <laughs> all right. These are cool. These are palm stones of different minerals. <laughs> um, so... <laughs> 
Corvus isn't laughing at me or anything. So I've got tourmaline with mica <laughs> in it. Extra price for sure, actually. Um, yeah. Septarian, <laughs> which is a dead stuff for anybody who likes that. Pyrite. This one's labradorite. And this one is, I have no freaking idea, but it's really cool. That one is stripey. It's stripey. Like, it might be verticrosite. I'm not, I'm really not sure on this one. I think it's too heavy to be rid of this type. And I don't know what it is. <clears throat> it's mystifying. Well. Striper right. Striper right. So says Jan. Could be rotocross I guess. That's but my best guess. But it feels too heavy. I, I don't know all of the everything. I don't know all of the everything either. I know either. most of the things. Oh, and one more palm stone. That one's Picture Jasper. That's cool. And then we have eggs. Eggs! Yes, so we have... Eggs I like! One <gasps> natural oh. geode agate egg. This one's pretty big. Like, use my hand for scale. That one had one, dinosaurs in it. This one is bigger than a chicken egg. Okay, it's more like a goose egg. But not the kind that I got on my knee when I fell. Or a wild turkey egg. Okay, so... I've never That's seen a wild turkey egg, but they're big. one of the extra cool specimens that I got. And then... Yeah. What okay. specimen? So they've been doing a lot of coating of crystals uh, with AB finishes and shiny finishes. And I'm kind of on the fence about that of, like, do I like it, do I not like it? But it really just kind of defaults to I like shiny things. And so... I'm what having... what are you What are you doing with the... Okay, don't do not do a Gwyneth Paltrow and like, put it in your hoo-ha, okay? Because... <laughs> no, that's not <laughs> good for anybody's hoo-ha! <laughs> Especially not with the druzy bits. No! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Dr. Harms would really have some things to say. <laughs> she definitely would. Um, but so, I did get this little egg that is agate, but it's coated. It's AB coated, just because it was so pretty. It's like the... I mean, if you were going to put an egg in your hoo-ha, this is a better size. But I still say not recommended. The BD Cream <laughs> Scheme is strongly against putting anything in yes. your hoo-ha. <laughs> well, I mean... It's made of rock. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. But yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's like one really pretty coated egg. <sighs> it, it is really sweet. <laughs> I'm not going to say nothing. Nothing, but nothing made of rocks. <laughs> nothing made of rocks. <laughs> All right, what is in here? <laughs> oh, this is dead stuff. Oh, so my lanta. <laughs> these are trilobites. These are ancient buggy things. <gasps> they are dead. D E D dead. Ah, can I touch it? Yeah, you can ask. <gasps> <laughs> so, so yeah, so I've got three of these. These are um, not it's your pre- little friend. <laughs> these are, okay, I need to borrow it back to show okay, people. Fine. Okay, These are but not primo I... trilobites, but they're really cool trilobite fossils, and I have three of these. Um, the good thing about them not being primo is they do not have a primo price tag on them. Sure. You can put that little one back in his blankie. <laughs> he has and a cheeky blankie. You can wrap him up with his plans. He has a 2020 COVID-19 blinky. <laughs> right. Um, <let's laughs> this see. would have doubled the price. Oh, crap. The big the, the big honker is in this box. I just found it. Oh, God. And that. Holy cow. That, okay. That has to be it. Well, there's two big honkers. Oh. This is the I got it to piss off Corvus big honker. I will say, so after years of doing this, I've finally gotten good at packaging things. <laughs> I've finally learned the virtue of double walled boxes. Mm. So, um, so far, Worth nothing, their weight. yeah, so far, nothing has been broken. <laughs> also, total shout out to the clerk who I don't know her name, but she was so sweet at the FedEx location in Denver because I bought four boxes. There were seven dollars a box, and we only used three. So I brought one box back to see if I could return it, but I didn't have the receipt because I had thrown it away because I was like, I don't need this. These are boxes. And she actually went back and looked up the purchase 
she, and oh, reprinted the so receipt sweet. so she could return the box for Aww, me. Oh, I love so, her. So yeah, the FedEx location on Quebec Street in Denver. Um, <laughs> right? Uh, highly recommend. Okay, so this is the <laughs> other. <laughs> yes, Ace. <laughs> All right, so this is the other. I want Corvus to scream. Oh stone. my goodness! Yeah. Sorry. So, hi Corvus. Look at that. Definitely don't put that anywhere in your. <laughs> no, good lord. Oh my god. <laughs> no. <laughs> put this on your bookshelf. That is not a metaphor. That's just. Show it nice and slow. Ooh. Right? <laughs> So yeah, this is a Labradorite, mm -hmm. big ass, gorgeous <laughs> of Labradorite. It is literally as big as my face. Some of that might have been from me, Ace. I don't know. <laughs> like, literally as big as my face. It can't be as big as my face because <laughs> I'm giant! <laughs> it is as big as your face. What? Uh, what? We got Corvus to curse. <laughs> Cheers. Oh. Do we have any more? Mm -mm. Do we have any more bottles in the fridge? Mm -mm. The, the grapefruit one? We can do that. Or what did Sheena bring us? Gin and... No, vodka and things. We have orange juice in the fridge. We do. We actually have vodka in the freezer. We do. Okay, so I feel like you should fix this problem. We could stay for longer than 25 minutes if we have a refill refill. It's going to take me a minute to drink this, though, so... If I try and chug it... No, then we won't Unfortunate things are going to happen, and... I feel like vomiting all over the equipment is not ideal. Nope. Okay, so the, the giant ammonite is in here. Leave the lab under the cam. Corvus wants her porn. Corvus wants what? She said leave the lab under the cam. <laughs> she said she wants her porn. That's fair. She it's wants like a background. She wants her Labradorite porn. I think that's fine. Okay, so there's more specimens. <laughs> All right. So I think we just have like two more specimens and then we're done with three more specimens and then we're done with this box. Are you done yet? <laughs> I'm kidding. God, she's so demanding, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> right? Corvus, are you alive? Oh yeah, that's cool. There's so much paper in this box, y'all. Like, I need to make sure I don't accidentally throw away anything that's a real product. Ugh. Oh my god, that's heavy. That's the big one. <laughs> Let's see, we've got more magazine pages. Anything good? Versace perfume. Let's see, how does it smell? Thank you. Versace perfume? Mm. Versace. <coughs> Ooh, that's nice. <laughs> My mom was like, well, I'm just going to put the perfume sample in there, and then the box will smell good. Okay, can I actually pass you this box? Yes. Okay, by the way, y'all, like... Oh, I like Crystal Noir better, though. Ah. Uh, so, yeah, this is the size of the box. Unsurprisingly, I like the dark version. <laughs> Alright, we do need to go through that just one more time to make sure that there's nothing left in it. Yeah. I think it's just paper, but... No, we don't want to make that mistake again. Yeah. I don't know if we as a store have made that mistake, but there definitely is 
an amethyst and diamond ring somewhere in a landfill <laughs> in <Right>. Asheville. <clears throat> Okay, and then we also <laughs> um, we also wrapped the some of the specimens in Vogue. So apparently, um, oh, I don't know what house this is, but apparently this is a thing. It's pretty cool. I mean, for people who aren't okay, you would actually spontaneously combust. I would if you were wearing that. But I would enjoy looking at it on a runway. Fair. I mean, it's a beautifully staged ad, but yeah, I don't know that a park address is, is for me at this stage of my life either. So what are you? Are you oh, this is so this is the good trilobite. So the other trilobites were were crunchy and and not premium trilobites. This isn't necessarily super premium trilobite, but it is pretty. Nice. So that is also a trilobite, an actual fossilized thing. I didn't know it was that big. Oh my gosh, I could walk it. <laughs> well, we're time it, sharing this trilobite, but, but Mary and I are time sharing. But it's how are you gonna walk it? It's dead. Are you gonna give In it a like wagon? A little, are you gonna give it little wheels? Yeah, a little wagon. Okay. And try I'm... Ziggy to. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So, so, so you're, you're, but you're, look, it even has a little face. Your, your trilobite will, will walk about in the, in the mini carriage with the, with the steed. Yes. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I will definitely. <laughs> I mean, look, I'm lonely. <laughs> but you have three plants now. I do have, th well, yeah. And, Oh, my snake plant has a volunteer. Yay! Yeah! Awesome. Yeah, I have actually doubled the snake plant. No, no, cat would be bad for me. I would explode and also probably murder it accidentally. The plants! To be fair, cats make it really hard for you to accidentally murder them because they're very demanding. But, to be fair, the trilobite is already dead. Has been it's, for a minute. It's impossible to murder <laughs> something that's already dead. That was not even, even kind of close. Not no. even close. <laughs> All right. Okay, so this is a new thing. These that are I'm... cool. Would you share some of these for errands? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm super. <laughs> for the tumbled rocks and that's just a and nice. Essie's gonna pick them up on Saturday. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> yes, the young is Essie is this big around and, and 17. 18. So 18. Super yeah. limber. Oh no! Oh, no! 
shit! <laughs> Moral relieved baboon whole wheat. Wow, <laughs> that's a thing. <laughs> Ross did yell that. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. They're free. They're free all over the floor. <laughs> All right, last specimen, and, and, we're, then, and then we're gonna do the ovals. <laughs> okay, the labradorite has to go, <laughs> <laughs> labradorite has to go somewhere else. Okay. <laughs> yes, at least we—they're not little tiny. Yeah, at least they're they're, they're large. <laughs> okay, and so this, I think, oh my god, that's heavy, <sighs> is legitimately the biggest fossil I've ever purchased. Sorry, I'm dead now. <laughs> well, that's okay. We're almost done. <laughs> I I will unwrap the large fossil and then show the opals. Oh, yay! <laughs> Sorry, there's a lot of bubble wrap because it's a very large fossil. My gosh, that is even better than I thought! <laughs> so, y'all! Uh, this is an ammonite fossil literally as big as my head. It's bigger than the labradorite! It is. It's less shiny, but... This is a legitimate ammonite fossil chunk. Uh, it doesn't really stand that is a on end. So boss. You would, yeah, you'd have to lay it flat, but it is yeah. We're gonna is, stand for it. We're gonna stand for it. It's just that's just bubble. <laughs> so so yeah, one gigantor. There's just a lot of gravity. Ammonite fossil. <laughs> and then oh Mama. Yeah, yeah. All right, and then <laughs> Heather really is gonna marry the trilobite, I think. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that the the exacto knife fell blade downward. My camera just completely <laughs> fell off. My yes, from the. <laughs> is saying it's time to wrap this business up. Oh my gosh, I've um, never laughed so much. So, I mean, I have, but... Okay, here. You're, <laughs> you're the camera person. <laughs> this is normal. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... Last... Do not knock over your... Drink. I will not. Okay, so last uh, thing of the night is of course the opals so these are ethiopian good job camera person thanks ethiopian opals they have been smoked which is a treatment that they do to darken them so that they have a black color background instead of a, a clear or yellow color background um they are all gorgeous every single one of these opals is beautiful they are marquee shaped they are top drilled, so the hole goes right through the point. And like like I said, there's not a bad one in the lot. So it is Pam, you're right. <laughs> so um, these this size, which is about half an inch, these are $23 per stone. And then I do have a few of the bigger ones, which are closer to three quarters of an inch. And those are thirty dollars per stone. So they're they, amazing. They are gorgeous. Like the camera, as hard as I'm trying to just hold it in place here, is not doing them justice. They are they are so pretty. Um so just for reference, um the full retail price for the full 16 inch strand yes you do of Tally those Fett. opals i'll grab tally Fett's opals in a second so the full retail price for a full strand of those particular opals because these are actually bigger than the ones that i did the video of online is about 2400 dollars. so you can absolutely get the 24 um tally Fett, do you want them to match or not <laughs> 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 it's 
Smaller were 20, 20 two and larger were 30. Two smaller for Sylvan. Okay. All right. So tally fat. Hold was... on a sec. Let me get some rocks out of the way. Heather's getting her rocks off. I'm getting my rocks off. So two smaller. The trophite is not going to two larger and four at smaller. All. No, that's no. Not, certainly not happening. All right, four. I'm time smaller, sharing it with larger. Mary, y'all. We agree. Okay, but if you take it to walk it in a little wagon, I want a photo. <laughs> I totally will if I can okay. find a little wagon. It's Those happening. Those are for Talifet. Okay. And then two smaller for Silvern. They're all so pretty! <laughs> they, they weigh the opposite of the ammonite. Right? Yes, because opals are very light. Let's do those two for silver and one big one, two small ones for Corvus. Small ones match it. Right. Mm -hmm. They seem appropriately Corvus like, don't they? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. <coughs> All right. Okay, so we've got, I think, everyone's, dang it, don't fall down, everyone's opal claims. Um, so yeah, I have a giant pile of stones to clean up tomorrow from the floor and the paperwork <laughs> box. <laughs> I still say we, we we can borrow Essie. She will not mind. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so yeah, it's 8.30. I think it's, I th once again, I think the universe was telling us it's time to be done with this broadcast. So thank you all so much for hanging out with us on the Beating Dream stream as we unbox new merchandise from Denver. We will, we, there's, <laughs> that was full at the time. It was full. Completely full. It wasn't closed, but it was full. Yeah, it's <clears> all <throat> on the floor now. Um, so we still have, there's still one more box, like one more full box. Yeah. So we will be back on this channel, twitch.tv <laughs> forward slash Beating Dream, assuming we survive tonight. Um with another box of stuff to show you all tomorrow and then of course saturday we are going to have an actual proper sale with everything priced and laid out um so <laughs> thank y'all so much for hanging out with us thanks for laughing with us thanks yes. for putting up with our, our <laughs> lunacy and um so i'm allison that's heather we're from beating dreams in dallas texas we'll see y'all back on this channel twitch.tv forward slash beating dream tomorrow at 6 30 p.m central time for more unboxing and more shenanigans. So everyone have a good night and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye.